like to talk about herbal teas. But today I know uh, many of you know about herbal teas. Mm. So I'm going to talk about different types and properties of herbal tea. <coughs> so, what is the herb? The herb is plant valued for its medicinal properties. Mm. And herbs are powerful, although some misguided people insist that they can't achieve much that. Fact is that they can be used successfully in a variety of cases. <coughs> and in most cases, uh, herbs have less side effects than other remedies. So herbal teas are teas made up from dried herb and spices. <coughs> Unlike other forms of tea, herbal teas contain no caffeine. And herbal teas can be a substitute for coffee or tea. They also taste great and they are easy to drink. <coughs> herbal tea may consist of one main herbal ingredient or it may be a blend of herbal ingredients mm, designed to bring about a specific purpose such as a relaxation, relief from a specific condition. So let's check out the general benefit that can be obtained from herbal teas. Herbal teas make people calm and can relax people's states of mind. <coughs> it's healthy for the heart and it aids and helps stomach and digestive problem. <coughs> it provides cleansing properties for the body. <coughs> it brings us energy and awareness. It nourishes the nervous system. It strengthens, strengthens the immune system. <coughs> and then I'll show you different kinds of herbs that can be used as a herbal ingredient, herbal tea ingredient. Jasmine <coughs> is an astringent and antibacterial herb. And jasmine also has a picture of an antiviral. And jasmine tastes pure and bitter and it calms nerves. Because it stimulates the uterus, it certainly is good for pregnant women. <coughs> In addition to jasmine, it's an aphrodisiac for women. Aphrodisiac is a natural term for arousing sexual desires. Um, if your boyfriend gives you Jasmine as a gift, uh, his intention is very clear. And yeah, that's why <laughs> we didn't know that. Yeah. Uh, Rosemary, <coughs> Rosemary has tonic and retorative and estrogen properties. And in the Nexus, Passes and increases the rate of perspiration. <coughs> and it improves <coughs> digestion and circulation and controls the pathogen orgasms. Sorry, orgasms. Organisms. Okay. Furthermore, it is also used for headaches. <coughs> It can also be used in diarrhea. <laughs> and it improves abilities of memorizing and concentrating. If you forget vocabulary every day, even you study a few minutes ago, you have to drink most my teeth. <laughs> Lavender. Lavender is a small shrub spread down in linear leaves and it has blue or violet flowers. <coughs> Lavender has aromatic and tonic characteristic and it is a herb that has a sweet scent. It relaxes patients, benefits the digestion, stimulates peripheral circulation and uterus, and it lowers fever. <coughs> it is an antiseptic and has a 
antidepressant effect. Besides, ramen is also used to treat insect bites. In Western, ramen is called natural painkiller. It is effective on a variety of pain, including toothache or headache. Next is reverse. This is a prison testing and mild oestrogen problem. The benefit is digestion while giving some relief in allergic and skin conditions. Because of the relieving effect, it is also used as a cosmetic ingredient. It is also makes a good non-stimulant health drink. Do you know Alz Alzheimer's disease? Yes, Alzheimer's. It is very awful disease. People who get this disease, this disease, they can remember themselves. But if you drink Rebus tea regularly, you can protect yourself against this disease. This onion pan with rope leaves and brightly colored flowers and woody stems. This color has directed direct properties and helps to lower fever as well as provide vitamin C. And it is traditionally used to treat loss of appetite, coarse, and respiratory tract infection. <clears throat> In addition to hibiscus contains some scientific material which break down sugar. <clears throat> so this can be protect us against fatness. Peppermint, it is cooling and fragrant and bitter herb. It is used to treat morning sickness, nausea, and it is used for indigestion or cramping and irritable bowel syndrome. <clears throat> it can be it can have powerful stimulating effect on the body and it also positively influences the mind and emotions. Furthermore, it helps to relieve itching and irritation and helps to cool skin and reduce redness. <coughs> the cinnamon tree is an um, evergreen tree with light brown, papery dark and red leaves. It is a fun pungent and sweet smelling warm hub. It stimulates the circulation and helps to control high blood pressure. It is used internally to stop digestive problems. This herb should not be used by pregnant women or anybody suffering from stomach aches. Chamomile is one of the most widely used herbs. It encourages digestion and boosts immune system. The chamomile has been used for centuries to calm people in case anxiety, especially insomnia. <clears throat> and it, it used by herbalists to treat on sunburn and bones and red ulcers. Also, this is all about my presentation. Thank you everyone for watching.